We hold these truths to be self-evident. All men and women created by the go, you know the you know the thing. The Me Too movement has forced a cultural reckoning around the issue of sexual violence and harassment against women in America. No man has a right to raise a hand to a woman in anger. And so we have to just change the culture, period, and keep punching at it and punching at it and punching at it. Very poor choice of words. We have this notion that somehow if you're poor, you cannot do it. Poor kids are just as bright and just as talented as white kids, wealthy kids, black kids, Asian kids. No, I really mean it, but think how we think about it. And why should the voters believe that you can win the national election? I was a Democratic caucus. You remember the caucus? No, you don't. You're a lying dog faced pony soldier. <laughs> I got your work straight, Jack. Look, look, man, look, this is you. I'm not voting for you. Well, I knew you weren't. Then you think I thought you stand up and vote for you? You're too old to vote for me. I'm not saying you're I don't like it up here. No, let, 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 let him go. Let him go. Look, the reason I'm running is because I've been around a long time and I've known more than most people. And I can get things done. That's why I'm running. You want to check my shape on Let's do push ups together, man. Let's do this run. Let's do whatever you want to do. Let's take my what the Taoiseach knows a lot about it. His mom uh, lived in uh, in Long Island for 10 years or so. Uh, God rest her soul. And uh, um, although she's your mom's still alive, your dad's back. God bless her soul. I gotta get this straight. Play the radio. Make sure the television, excuse me, make sure you have the record player on at night. Corn Pop was a bad dude. And he ran a bunch of bad boys. And I did, Dave. And back in those days, you shot sure things had changed. One of the things you had to use, if you used pomade in your hair, you had to wear a bathing cap. And you cut off the six foot left the chain, you pulled up and you walk out with that chain. And you walked as far as you you may cut me, man, but I'm gonna wrap this chain around your head. So I walked out with the chain. And I walked up to my car. And then their those days used to remember the straight bridge, you could bang them on the curb, get them rusty, put them in a rain barrel, get them rusty. And to get hot, I got a lot of, I got hairy legs that turn, that, 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 that turn uh, uh, blonde in the sun. And the kids used to come up, reach in and pull, and rub my leg down so it was straight, and then watch the hair come, come back up again. They'd look at it. So I learned about roaches. I learned about kids jumping on my lap. And I've loved kids jumping on my lap. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> You're Thank you. All right. Well, nice to see you guys. Do you remember what I told you? No, not smile. No date till you're 30. <laughs> okay. okay, there we go. Well, let's get the senator in here. <laughs> he does. <laughs>